you know, I, I had always been self-employed. I worked out of my home and I was called to, you know, through agencies to go here, go there. So I was a single mom at the time and I did a lot of traveling. I did a lot of flying. I did asbestos litigation. This was set hours with benefits and insurance. We all had this idea that being an official was just totally not what we wanted to do. My evenings are free, my weekends are free, and I didn't know that. I didn't know what that felt like because as a freelancer, you're always busy. You're always working 24-7, uh, seven days a week to get those transcripts out. They are extremely understanding of parenting, that being a parent is so important and we want to be at our kids' games and we want to be, you know, at, we have to take them to doctor's appointments and stuff. In the freelance world, you just have to figure it out because if you don't work, you don't make any money. You have sick days, you have vacation, um, uh, just a flexible schedule, more flexible than what I thought. Once I became an official, I really thought I was going to make a lot less, but after about a year, I started realizing I was making more and I didn't have the expenses that I had as a freelancer. I didn't have to pay and my taxes, they were taking out for me. So come April every year, I didn't owe a big amount of money. And it, I have just found that I was making more bottom line. I had freelance insurance, you know, I mean, on the open market, which isn't great. I mean, you pay out the nose and they try to cover nothing. Um, the insurance here is incredible. I really didn't understand the whole pension, how that works, how valuable that is, or how valuable the um, health insurance and deferred comp and Flex spending. I didn't know anything about any of that. Didn't know that that was even available to me. So that's really a huge plus of being an official is having those things. Honestly, I would say quit breaking your back freelancing and traveling all over and taking job after job after job and come work at a place where you can come to the same place every day. You know, work 8:30 to 4:30 with other people and develop relationships with your judge, with the attorneys that you see every day. If it's not for you, then that's fine, but give it a chance. Uh, it definitely is worth uh, checking into. It is a great career.